This is a Foley catheter. And if you see, there is a little port on the side. This is the balloon port. This is where the urine comes out. And this part is in your bladder. So let me show you. So if you take some water, okay, I'm gonna, it, it doesn't matter water or, or saline, but I'll, I'll explain to you what that is later. You find, you have a clean cup, doesn't have to be sterile. Then I take a syringe, usually use a 10 or 12 cc syringe. You draw up the fluid, okay, and then you put it in to this, you see it's a Y connector, so the urine is coming out of here. This is where you fill the balloon so the catheter doesn't fall out, right? So I'm gonna connect this. I don't know if you want to zoom in on this. You here. So you see, I you watch the end of it. While I fill the balloon through the port, you see the balloon gets bigger. You see that? Then this balloon is what keeps the catheter from falling out. So this balloon also will irritate the bladder and can be somewhat annoying and make you feel like you have to pee. So let me show you uh, what it looks like. To deflate the balloon, I'm going to disconnect the AC here and pull back. The other thing you can do is if you fill it, all you have to do, you don't have to draw back. You just push it together and wait. Just wait. Wait five, 10 seconds, you'll see it come back. You see how the plunger is coming back? So usually, most people put seven or 10 cc's, seven to 10 milliliters of water. So that's how much you have to pull out before removing a cath. 